My lord. I've completed my patrol of the encampment, my lord. My patrol, whatever. All appears to be in order. I found no sign of the enemy nearby. I believe we are safe here for the night. Good. Good to hear. Thank you, Frederick. Ah. While on my rounds, I took it upon myself to inspect our weaponry as well. I've placed any items that showed exceptional wear outside your pavilion. Be your choice to sell or repair them, sire. I recommend swift action. Really? Oh, well, you have been busy. Your work ethic always impresses, Fred. Always impresses, Frederick. I almost feel lazy by comparison. No. Nonsense. I've done nothing more than my duty as a knight of Elise. Oh, and uh, beg pardon, my lord, but I noticed you often cause a ruckus when training. With that in mind, I reinforce the tents near any open areas you'd like to use. Forgive me. Third, yes, I see. Sorry for the trouble. Really? No trouble at all, my lord. Happy to help. Also, uh, with the nights growing colder, I procured blankets from a nearby village. I've readied a, a variety of colors, so you might pick the which best suits you. If I may be so bold, sire, peach would seem to be the best flatter for your complexion. Uh, but perhaps blue, just to be safe? Yes, that's best. Blue it is. Here you are, my lord, and two sets of spares, just in case. Hmm. Frederick, do you ever tire? Well... Of course not, my lord. I am here to serve. Ah, and uh, one final thing. I've taken measures to raise troop numbers and morale. Uh, I had an artisan create posters emblazoned with your noble image. It's my lord in a bold pose. Naked. Save a scale in one hand and sword in the other. And at your feet, a scrawled our new recruiting motto, Crom wants you. I had them pinned inside each and every tent. Surely the troops will be thrilled to rally behind their common leader, my lord. Huh? Wait, you did what? In whose you hung this pick it's in everyone's tents? Indeed. No need for thanks, my lord. Merely doing my duty. And that concludes my report. Rest well, sire. Listen. For Frederick, wait, we really need to talk. Oh, gods. I've got to tear those posters down before anyone sees them. Hmm? Hmm. Oh, hey, Sully. Krom. Hello, Krom. Listen. Are you here alone? I thought you'd be with Lissa and the rest of the women. Hell no. Why? So I can make dinner for all the brave men? Nuts to that. I'll tend the fire. What? That seems like a lot of hard work for one person. <laughs> Would you rather I cook or sew? No, thanks. I hate all that crap. Really? Huh. Well, I guess I understand. You don't seem like much of a... Nah. Right. What? A lady? Go ahead. Say it. No, no sweat off my thighs. <laughs> okay, then. I guess everyone has their own special traits. Say, I can't really cook or sew either. Can I at least help with the fire? Yeah. <laughs> You're alright, Krom. 